Kazakhstan is looking to diversify and it's hoping to use the brain power of its younger generation to help try to power the economy away from just oil, gas, and minerals. And joining me now with more on that plan is economist Darman Sadvakasov. Come on in here and uh, join us. Good to have you with us. Good evening. You are a case in point of a young person here in Kazakhstan who studied abroad. You went to Carnegie Mellon. Yeah. But it's a unique program that this government has. Tell us about it. Uh, this program uh, was created by, by the president uh, many years ago. Uh, it's named Bolashak that can be translated into English as a future. And uh, already 8,000 servants were given to the young, talented people. So I get into university in the United States, in Britain, anywhere. Anywhere, in, in the best universities. And of the, the world. government pays my way. And government pays all, all, all the expenses for, for young Housing, people. everything. Everything, yeah. And then you're expected, though, to come back and work in Kazakhstan? Yeah, people have to have to come back. However, they, they are not obliged to, to work for the government. Uh, according to statistics, only 19, 20 percent go to, to the government. And uh, Where do they go? They go into private yeah, enterprise? Most, most people go to the private NGOs and wherever they want. Now, most young people that study abroad, a lot of them end up abroad. They never go back to their home countries. What is, what's it like here? From these 8,000 people, uh, four and a half uh, already came back to Kazakhstan and three and a half are still uh, studying abroad and I think that less one not I think but it's statistics less than one percent uh, didn't come back so it's a tremendous number Does that well, most people prefer to come back because they think that in, in Kazakhstan they have uh, big opportunities for their careers so people are optimistic a good reason to be uh, people are very optimistic and they believe in this country they believe that th this country will give them uh, good opportunities in the World Bank believes in it too, doesn't it? And World Bank says the same because because in its report, uh, doing business, uh, Kazakhstan is in top 50 countries. Darman, you are, we got to say this, you're a, you're a chess grandmaster. You had a very young age you were. What's the next smart move for this economy, for this government? Uh, this economy uh, still, uh, is, is still dependent on, on, on the raw materials sector oil and gas sector and uh, w what is needed to, to do is to diversify the economy and that's why uh, the government tries to, to prepare specialists in different engineering spheres for example this Bolashak program uh, more than 50 percent go to engineering and technical technical programs and they came they come back and they, they go f to, 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 to the uh, work market and they, 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 they will create some, something in this country.